first set of tubes under test are the RCA. We've got the um, just as Dynaco recommended, we've got it set to 1.56. It drifts slightly, not very much. Try to keep it as close as we can. Line voltage is 120. Input, 2 kilohertz output. We're going to see what she does. We're going to test it as close as we can to about a half percent distortion for maximum output. There's 0.7% at 21.7. 0.7 at 21.7. 2 kilohertz. Nice sine wave. Now it's at 0.6, 21.6 volts. 21.6 volts is 21.6. Squared divided by eight. Fifty eight point three watts. Not bad. We'll lower it and then we're gonna go to twenty hertz. There's our twenty. Twenty, twenty one. Just our oscilloscope so we can see it. Let the oscillator stabilize. There we go. Run it back up. See our voltage rising. The other one we ran up to about 0.6 to 0.7 percent distortion. Doing very well. Nice clean sine wave. Doing excellent. There we go. There's about it. There's about where we were a while ago. 20 volts. Jumping around a little bit, you can see right down here a little bit of distortion on the sine wave. And it's indicated here, it starts to jump around. You can see this fluctuating somewhat. We might want to back it down just a little bit just so we can get rid of that. There we go. Now we got rid of that big glitch. Now we're at 0.2 percent at 19 more than 9. We'll call that 20. 20 squared is 400 divided by 8 is 50 watts. You got 50 watts at 20 hertz. That is the two RCAs. Doing very well.